I think it's time for another giveaway challenge, don't you? Um, it's been a while. It's been about a year, I guess, since I've given anything away. So, um, this seems like a good time. I've got almost 2,000 subscribers, which is crazy. Um, I don't know how that happens. Anyway, uh, and I, you know, of course, dearly love and appreciate each and every one of you. So I put together a box of stuff to give away as soon as I hit 2,000, which should be, I think I'm about 50 short, so the challenge will start maybe about within the next week or 10 days, because that, that's usually about how long it'll take me to get 50 more subscribers. Unless for some reason it just comes to a screeching halt, which I'm always, every time I talk about, you know, doing a giveaway and after I get a certain number of subscribers, I'm just convinced it will all come to a screeching halt and that'll be the end of it. You know, whatever. <laughs> anyway, should I hit 2,000 anytime in the near future, I've put together some stuff to give away. But it's not going to be easy. This is probably going to make y'all mad. Um, I hope it doesn't, and I hope you understand why I'm doing it, but I'm going to do it a little different. I think last time I just had everyone, you know, leave a comment here, and, <clears throat> excuse me, for an extra entry, you know, maybe put one on my blog, I think that's what I did, and that's what I see most people doing. Um, you know, recently I've seen several that are, you know, you leave a comment on YouTube, go uh, follow the blog and leave a comment, like the Facebook page and leave a comment, follow me on Instagram, send me a tweet, you know, all these different hoops to jump through, which makes me crazy. I don't even enter giveaway challenges anymore because the entry process makes me crazy. Um, and I, I get it, I understand, especially those people, artists and crafters who have um, corporate sponsors, you know, they really need to get more subscribers and more exposure to their um, social media presence. And I totally understand that. I'm not one of those. I don't have corporate sponsors. I'm not on a design team. <clears throat> I don't have any desire to be. So, you know, I don't need to rake in subscribers for any reason at all. Um, I'm fine with two subscribers or 20,000. Actually, that's a lie. You know what I want? I want 100,000 subscribers. And you know why I want 100,000? Because if you hit that mark, YouTube sends you a free gift. How cool is that? I did not know that. I just learned that recently, that YouTube sends you stuff if you get 100,000 subscribers. So maybe I should be out there trying to get more subscribers so I can get a free camera bag or whatever the heck they send you. <laughs> Okay, anyway, here's what I want to do. I wanted to do I want to do it a little bit different because I want everyone to have the opportunity to win. I'm really not all about just, you know, people coming in out of the blue and subscribing just so they can get a chance to win the free stuff. You know, if it happens, it's fine. You know, what are you going to do? I would rather give away this box to um, y'all that are here and new subscribers are perfectly fine but I would rather them be new subscribers who are here to to watch the videos and to interact and to have fun not just here to win some stuff you know because this is my stuff I, I don't like I said I don't have companies sending me free stuff to give away anything I give away it comes out of my own stash or my own pocket so, um, you know, I don't want to hand pick who to give it to, but I do want to, or I do hope that I can give it to someone who um, actually watches my videos. Does that make sense? Is that snobby? I don't know. Maybe it is. I don't know. We'll see. See, now my subscribers are just going to, you know, run scattering. I'll be down to four by tomorrow, but I'll tell you what, us four, we're going to have fun. <laughs> Okay, anyway, the reason that I'm doing this little giveaway teaser is because you're going to need some time. I 
am going to, when I start the giveaway, which like I said, is probably going to be a week, maybe two, I'm going to have a series of questions that you're going to have to answer. They are going to be questions that um, the answers will be on some video I've done in the past. I promise I am not going to pick really obscure questions from like the first video I ever did that no one in their right mind would even remember. I'm going to pick questions that you know I've mentioned off and on several times. They're going to be, some of them are going to be kind of personal questions about me. Some of them are going to be specific questions about the videos, but they will be questions that everyone can, if you don't already know the answer to, which if you watch my videos, you're going to know the answer. But if you don't, it, it, I will not make it all that difficult to go and find it. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I'll be doing videos between now and the challenge, and I'm going to try between now and then to give you answers to those questions in the upcoming videos. You may not realize that I'm answering the questions because you won't know what the questions are going to be. Um, but I will provide you with the answers in upcoming videos if they're not already blatantly obvious in previous ones. Okay, questions I'm talking about, they're going to be things like, um, what's my husband's name? How many children do I have? Um, why do I carry lotion in my purse? See, that's not something I mention on every video, but it should be pretty easy for you to find the video that has that answer. I'm not saying that that's going to be one of the challenge questions. I'm just saying it'll be something like that. Um, what color is the inside of my car? Okay, I've written down. See, I'm writing down ideas as I come up with them. Um, where is my tattoo? That might actually be a bonus question. Why do I cough up a lung in almost every video? Because <laughs> I do in almost every video, and I tell you why in almost every video. <laughs> so it's going to be stuff like that. It's going to be things where if you watch my videos, you're probably going to know the answer. If you don't already know, I will make it, uh, if not super easy, at least possible for you to find the answer. <laughs> And that is kind of my way, I, I'm hoping that by doing it that way, that um, I can make it maybe even, no, not a little easier. I want it to be fair for everyone. I want to make sure that the people who are entering the challenge are people who are watching my videos and not just, you know, strays who come in because they want the free challenge stuff. You know what I'm saying? Does that make sense? I don't know. I may be saying it all wrong and just sound like a terrible person, but I do want to be fair to everyone. I just want to make sure that um, the everyone I'm being fair to are the ones who are watching the videos and not the, the chronic contest enterers. You know what I'm talking about. So that's my goal. It's not my goal to run anyone off or, you know, be elitist or, or unfair or anything. Um, just kind of to see how well you're paying attention. Maybe that's it. Yeah. Okay. And what are you going to win? Is it really going to be worth all that effort? Well, heck if I know. <laughs> but here's what I've got. I'm putting together this box. <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> I have allergies. You see? You see what I did there? <laughs> you see? Okay. Um, I'm putting together this box. So far, it's about two and a half pounds, and I'm trying to get it up to three pounds. And this stuff in here is from my own stash that I'm going to give to the winner. There will be one winner, and this is what they're going to get. Oh, goodness. And y'all tell me as I go through this, if there's something that I have that you want, <laughs> tell me what it is so I can add it to the box. Because I find that most of the time, y'all know what I have better than I do. Um, okay, first of all, let's get to the bottom of the box. Papers. Yes, those are hand-painted papers in there. You are going to get 
a whole bunch of my hand painted uh, papers. Some are drop papers, some are actual painted papers. You've probably seen me do some of these on videos. These are some Citrusolve pages. You're going to get a handful of Citrusolve pages. You are going to get a uh, mini smashbook, a brand new mini smashbook. You know, hot off the clearance rack at the Walmarts. So there you go. You're going to get a journal, handmade by me. It is not finished yet. I haven't finished putting pages together and then sewing it in, but um, I will finish it and you will get it. And this is one of those um, Wonder Under covers that I made on one of the videos. So you'll get that. You will get a package of colored glue sticks because I found them um, really cheap the other day. So I got several. You will get a little package of my um, paper beads that I made. And this has got kind of a kind of an, a fall theme because fall's coming up pretty soon. Oh, please God, let fall get here. It has been so hot. Yesterday, I don't even remember what it was yesterday, like 102, and the humidity was like 97% or something. I don't even know, but the heat index was approximately the surface of the sun, basically, is what it was. It was so dang hot. So I'm ready for fall where it will cool off to just tolerably hot. Um, but anyway, that's that's kind of the colors we've got going here. Some nice, deep, rich fall colors. You will get some chipboard um, doodahs and a, a big plastic button so that you can put your own closure on there if you want. Then you're going to get a, an assortment of just everything you could possibly need to deck out your junk journal and or your smash book. You're going to get, well right here, you're going to get a couple of my paper dolls because we all need paper dolls. And in here I've got, oh these are some little um, just die cut thingies and some images and some tags and some labels and some uh, journaling uh, cards for you to put in your books. So there's what that is. And see you can even use this little sack that they're in. And he, oh got away. Let's see, another envelope. This one has got, oh, this is an envelope full of envelopes. Um, little, look, glassine, coin envelopes, and oh, a CVS bag, because Lord knows I've got plenty of those. And you're going to have, oh yeah, this will be, this will be a lovely handwritten note by me, as soon as I find out who you are. And this is one of my doodles that, uh, it's not an original, it's printed onto a card. So you'll get one of those. You will get this envelope full of, ah uh, yes, we have napkins, just an assortment of some various napkins, even some of my brand new cool ones I just got. And some, oh, this is um, sticky post-it thingies, some note papers for your junk journal, and some post-its, and some tabs, and, you know, if you're, if you do the whole file effects thing, this will be, this will be fun for you. So, there's that. And they're stuck on a clear plastic thing that you can put into your planner if you like. And I will go crazy trying to shove that in there, so I'll do that later. And you will also get another envelope full of little bits and pieces for your journals. 
some button cards, some paint chips, some those and those, and you know, um, notepad papers and all kinds of stuff, and then some found papers, some leftover. See, that was from another journal I did and didn't use that sheet. <clears throat> some vintage stuff. Um, then, oh, one of my, and I hoard these because the, I love these. I have a whole book of this handwritten bookkeeping journal from the 1940s. And I'm going to actually give you a page of it. I might throw some vintage recipes in there, too, because I've got a bunch of those. I don't know what all else to put in here. That's what I've got so far. So, um, yeah, if you think of anything else that I should put in there, just let me know, and I will shove it in and continue to fill this up until it's time to give it away. Ha! There we go. Um... So that's what it's going to be. So anyway, this is your heads up on what to pay attention for. You know, just little details um, in the upcoming videos. And this will be open to international folks as well. Don't want to leave y'all out. And um, that's it. I think that's it. I hope it will be fun. I promise I will make it fun. It won't be hard. It will, like I said, you'll probably already know the answers to a lot of the questions. And, of course, I'm going to be pretty lenient on the answers. You know, if you get pretty darn close, <laughs> I'm going to give it to you. Um, but that's my plan. I may wake up tomorrow and change my mind. You know how these things go. But for now, that's my plan. And as soon as I hit 2,000, we will do this thing. And someone will get this box of goodies. Um, until then, that is all I have. Okay. Bye.